Ladies and gentlemen, their excellencies, the Governor General of the Commonwealth of Australia and Her Lady Excellency Lady Cosgrove and their Royal Highnesses the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. What a gathering. I acknowledge the traditional owners of the land in which we meet. You've been most welcome on your past visits and you have uh, been uh, almost a son of Australia in all that time. You have a bond with the people of this nation and we know that with this visit that just becomes even stronger. Your Royal Highness, uh, welcome to Australia for the first time. From the time of your engagement through your courtship and then uh, further into your, your marriage, uh, we've been very anxious to have you here so we could adopt you as well. This has now occurred and of course we are absolutely delighted and this group now would wish to show our delight at your uh, expecting a baby. Congratulations. <laughs> Your Royal Highness, I know that you might like to make some remarks now. The podium is yours. Uh, good day, Your Excellency, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> it is obviously great to be back in Australia, uh, and especially even more so, this is my wife's first visit here, um, so I'm very excited to show her this incredible country of yours. Uh, perhaps not Kangaroo Flats military training area in Darwin, though. That'll be the last time I go there. Thank you to your, to your Excellency and Lady Cosgrove for giving us your magnificent home for the week. We're inviting all of our mates in Sydney to visit, <laughs> including you guys. And finally, um, we're both absolutely delighted to be here and really impressed to see you serving beer and tea at an afternoon reception in true Aussie style. Um, but genuinely, thank you for the, for the incredibly warm welcome and the chance to meet so many Aussies from all walks of life. And we, genu and we also generally couldn't think of a better place to announce uh, the, uh, the upcoming baby be it a boy or a girl so thank you very very much <laughs>